Hi, my name is Pedro Romero and I'm a solution consultant here at ServiceNow and today it is my pleasure to introduce a new feature that's coming out with our Xanadu release that gives organizations the ability to better control their AI spend using cloud cost management. Now we do have a safe harbor notice as we might have some forward looking statements so feel free to pause and read this if you need to. Otherwise, let's go ahead and jump right in. And with Xanadu, we've added to our cloud cost management solution by introducing AI spend management. Because if you're like most organizations, you've likely heightened your AI strategy, which is also correlated with heightened costs. So we've made it simple to control and govern your AI costs with extended visibility that's going to help you understand not just what cloud service did you purchase, you know, for example, Amazon recognition, but what is the specific AI service you're receiving from that? You know, for example, image processing. And so with that, we'll be able to understand what are the costs associated with each of these specific AI services being consumed. And then secondly, you can start getting uh, control over things like budget. For example, understanding what are the budgets that these AI services are aligned with and are we projected to stay below budget? And ultimately, this allows you to continue adopting AI at scale while maintaining adherence to your cloud cost policies, again, with full control over your spend. So let's take a look at AI spend management in action. So now we're in our cloud cost management workspace, and we're going to start investigating our AI spend by digging into the spend analytics page by drilling into this graph right here. And so this took us to our spend analytics, and this is where we can group and filter our cloud cost data to simplify how we analyze our costs. And what we're going to do is let's start by grouping by our service category of machine learning. So I'm going to go in here and put in machine learning, and this is going to let us know how much was spent this month on machine learning, which is roughly $390,000. Now, what we're going to do is let's try to understand how much of this was tied to AWS. So I can go over here and put in AWS. And so roughly $40,000 here for machine learning is coming from AWS. Now, let's take a look at our cloud services under AWS that this is now being tied to. So I can go over here and group this by cloud service. And so now we know the specific cloud services that we're spending money on through AWS. For example, Amazon Translate or Amazon Recognition, these AI tools that exist. However, this isn't necessarily telling us what the AI service specifically is doing or what the AI sp service specifically is. So new with Xanadu, what we're able to do is we can go in here and we can actually group by a tag category of AI service. And now we can get granular visibility into what we're spending money on from an AI service perspective. For example, how much of our spend is going to text translation versus image processing versus detecting dominant languages, right? So these categories get defined in service now because as we're ingesting cost and usage billing uh, cost usage cost and usage billing data, we can determine what products, meter categories, or service descriptions from AWS, Azure, and Google, respectively, are considered AI spend. And then we can use this tag-based approach in ServiceNow to categorize these appropriately. And again, this is going to give you granular detail into where your costs are running high across different AI services. And so using these tag categories, we can start visualizing this and we can start leveraging this to control our costs and properly govern our AI strategy. And with that, that's everything I plan on showing in this quick, short tech bite. But if you want to learn more about how AI spend management can help your organization to control those AI costs, please, please, please continue to work with your accounting. So again, my name is Pedro Romero. Thank you so much and please continue to check out some more of our release videos for Xanadu.